Corbin Martin making this start here at home against the Chicago Cubs in three this season. He has pitched in 12 and two-thirds innings. He has 12 strikeouts, six walks at ERA at almost at five, and the whip at 1.58. Got roughed up last time out. Had some real issues with command, but hopefully made the adjustment in between these starts. Here's Baez coming off his second career 0 for 5 five strikeout performance. Here's a bullet into right field a base hit sharp ground ball Baez goes the other way. It's a one out single for Baez. That ball punched out into shadow left center. Baez on his way to third he'll cruise in there and the Cubs have it cooking here in the first. Well how many times have we seen that from Rizzo this year you make a mistake he hits it out of the ballpark you make a good pitch and he breaks your heart. Swing and a miss. Fastball up. Contreras goes down. A nice strikeout there for Martin for the second out. And it's up to Albert Almora Jr. Come back her, but past the mound. Kent will backhand it and tag the bag with his glove ahead of the sliding Anthony Rizzo. Corbin Martin works through a couple of hits. Strands two. John Lester pitching tonight. And not real happy with the uh, the way the last two have gone after a terrific start. Swing and a miss. Striking out is Fisher, chasing a low outside bender, out number one. Two on and one out for Yuli Guriel. This ball driven deep to left field. Schwarber back. He's at the fence, and it's going to be off the fence. That'll score at least one run. Bregman will score. Brantley to third. RBI double for Yuli Guriel. Jason Hayward sat out yesterday at some soreness near his hip after the outfield collision with the Bryant on Sunday. In the air to deep left. Brantley will watch it go into the Crawford boxes. That ties the game at 1 1. Welcome back, Jay Hay. And Hayward has tied the game with his eighth home run of the year. It's 1 to 1 here in the second inning. Addison steps in. Russell in the air, deep to right. They go back to back. Cubs lead 2 to 1. Addison Russell starting to look like the Addison of 2016. That is his third home run in the last three games that he has started. And that'll bring up David Bodie. Bodie, a fly ball to left. They've hit three in the inning. Number five for David. I'm trying to go down and away, and it's in and up a little bit. And in the right ballpark, and out. But in this ballpark, Four bases for Bodie. Two away, and now time for the first major league at bat for Garrett Stubbs. Swung at the first pitch he saw, and this one driven to left center field, and that's going to be off the wall for a base hit. Stubbs into second base, a double with two outs. Another exciting moment for the Houston Astros and the Garrett Stubbs family who are here. Here's Jason Hayward. He led things off in the second inning, really got the Cubs going. And on the hands, poked out into center field. Marizda coming in. Diving makes the catch. A brilliant play by Marizda once again. Nobody better in center than Jake Marizda. Bottom of the third inning, Alex Bregman will lead things off. Bregman shoots one into right field. Pretty well hit. Hayward back. This ball's gone. Number 16 on the air. Alex Bregman cuts the lead in half. It's now 3-2. to two. Well, the Astros down by one, but they have two runners in scoring position with one out, and that'll bring up Garrett Stubbs. This ball is looped into left field, and that's down for a hit. Garrett Stubbs, two for two, ties the game with an RBI single. Good job battling against John Lester, who threw him some tough pitches early on, keeping it just out of the reach of Addison Russell. First single of his career and the first RBI. Here's Fisher. He's 0 for 2. He's got a chance to do something here. That ball's ripped into center field, and that is down for a hit. Bounces away from Almora Jr. Stubbs is heading the third. Derek Fisher gives the Astros the lead once again. It's four to three. Two outs, and it'll be up to Michael Brantley here. Into left center field. Back goes Schwarber. This ball's going to be down off the wall. Two run score. Brantley into second base. Astros lead this game six to three. There's a bouncer to third. Diving stop, Bodie. What a play. Throws to first, and he got him. Sensational play by David Bodie at third base. He saved a run, and that ends the inning. David Bodie, the batter. Bodie already with one long home run. He also made a fantastic defensive play. Fly ball to right. That's deep. At the wall. Gone. A two homer game, David Bodie. Cubs within a run. 
Bodie with one to left, now one to right. Fourth long ball for the Cubs tonight. This game is a long way from over. Schwarber 0 for 2. He's drawn a walk. Schwarber hits a high drive. Deep right center. This ball's got a chance. Tie game. Kyle Schwarber with a towering home run to right center. In the bullpen, it almost hit the ceiling. And just like that, this ball game is tied 6-6. Right-hander Brad Brock facing a tough cookie and Alex Bregman. And Bregman sends one deep to right field. Alex trying to give the Astros the lead again. He does! Almost the same spot. Bregman, two home run night. Astros lead 8-6. to six. Bregman now with 17 bombs on the air. He has tied George Springer. For the most of the American League and obviously the team lead as well. Now Rondon on in the seventh. Little pop up. Tony Kemp a long run. Can he get there? Yes, he wow. can. Tony Kemp takes out part of the foul line as he dives for that catch. That is a huge play. That is a great play by Tony Kemp. So Marisnik has a chance, runner on third, but there's two out. Jake, a line drive. That'll score a run. RBI for Marisnik. He cruises into second base. It is 9-6 Astros. 9-6. Astros lead the Cubs, ninth inning. Roberto Osuna on to try and get the final three outs. Line drive caught by Yuli Gurriel. Astros win it 9-6. Roberto Osuna the save. On back-to-back -back nights tonight, a clean one, two, three in it.